students how are you all i hope you all are fine today we will continue with the chapter the junk seller today's topic is profit and loss we will see a story this is the story of mr sen he has a toy shop where he sells different types of toys but do you know from where mr sen get these toys for his shop he buys the toys from the factory factory is the place where toys are manufactured so from those factories mr sen buy the toys for his shop to buy the toys mr sen need some money those money is called cost price of mr sen so suppose mr sen buys a toy for his shop this is a teddy a teddy bear suppose mr sen buys this teddy bear from the factory so when mr sen buy the teddy bear from the factory he have to give some money to the factory that is the cost price suppose mr sen have given rupees 200 to the factory to buy the teddy bear that means cost price of mr sen is rupees 200 now suppose mr some customer come to the shop to buy that teddy bear and mr sen sell that teddy bear to the customer so suppose the mr sen sell the teddy bear by rupees 500 so this rupees 500 is the selling price of mr sen so the cost price of the teddy bear was rupees 200 because mr sen buy the teddy bear from the factory for rupees 200 so the cost price of the teddy bear is rupees 200 and mr sen sell the teddy bear to the customer by rupees 500 so 500 is the selling price of the teddy bear so we can write here cost price cp cp is the short form of cost price so cost price of the teddy bear is rupees 200 whereas selling price that is sp of the teddy bear is rupees 500 do you know one thing when selling price is greater than cost price the shopkeeper makes a profit the shopkeeper makes a profit and when cost price is greater than selling price when cost price is greater than selling price the shopkeeper make a loss which is very sad for the shopkeeper so we will see few definitions here cost price the price at which an article is purchased is called its cost price so cost price is the amount or the price by which an article is purchased selling price at a price at which an article is sold is called its selling price next profit if selling price is greater than cost price seller is said to have a profit or gain and loss if selling price is less than cost price the seller is said to have a loss so you come to know about four different things in the video number 1 cost price number 2 selling price number 3 profit number 4 loss so we will do sums based on this cost price and selling price in the next video thank you